Hello everyone. So today we are going to solve the problem of the day. Ticket counter. And in this problem we have been given n people who are standing in a queue at a movie ticket counter. And the queue distributes the ticket counter distributes the first K the tickets to the first K people and then to the last K and again to the first K and so on. And our task is to find out who's the last person to collect the ticket from the counter. So let us look at the test case. We have n equals nine and k equals three. So for n equals nine, we have one to nine integers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and nine so the ticket counter will give to the first three tickets to the first three people and then the again the three tickets to the last three people and then again to the first three so the last person would be six right that should so while give so let me explain again in the while giving the first three tickets, it will give it like this from the front. And while giving the next three tickets, it will give from the opposite direction from the last, last K people. And again, from the third, in the third attempt, it will give the three tickets to these three peoples. And the last one would be six. So that's the answer. So what we can do is let me again write the test case. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we can take two pointers, A and B, and we can use the DQ because we have insertion and deletion operation easy. We cannot use Q because it would be it would be difficult in order to get the last element, right? Because DQ allows us to insert or delete in the both direction from the back and the front as well. So what we can do is place one pointer here and another at here and keep on uh, while K, while our A is not equals to K, we keep on decreasing and once it gets equals to K, we decrement from here. Now, the point is, how do we make sure that where the last, our last element will lie? So if, if uh, we, can, we can take a current pointer, which will point to the first, after deleting the first three element, our current pointer will point to the back, back of the queue. And after deleting the last two element, our current pointer should point to the first element of the queue, right? So that's how it should be. So let me code this solution for you. And then I, I hope you will get the idea. So both A and B will be initially initialized to zero. And this is my current pointer, which will point to the head or the back, depending on the counter that gave ticket to which first or last people. So let me declare my DQ. There should be an. So I have inserted all the n people in my DQ. Now what I have to do is not q dot mt. If my 
is not equal to a right i'll keep on incrementing my a but before that i will be popping out the first element right as i said q dot pop front okay and then my current pointer should point on the back of the the back of the queue right and after deleting the first two elements my current pointer will point on the back and after deleting this last two elements my current pointer will again point to the first right so that how i will get to know which element to delete and it will also help me in while returning my answer now if if my k is equal to a then i will go for i will go for b right so i will increment my b but before that i will do dot pop back i will delete the last element and then if in any case my a and b become equal or you can say my k or b become equal then i will again initialize my a and b to zero because i have completed one cycle right i have deleted element from the first and from the last as well again i have to delete the element from the first right so i will initialize both of them to zero and then i will make my current point to the front of the queue and at last i will return my answer so let us compile and run and check if it is correct so let us submit all right thank you